Welcome back, folks. Welcome back, folks. It's me. It's Bobo. Your buddy. Your guy. And we're gonna play Let's Play Castle of Winds 2. Look, Prinzers. That guy's Bane. And, uh... We've healed up a little bit. But, uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and explore the rest of the floor before we go over to that room. Where, uh, the stone giants were. For one... There may still be some smirking sneak thieves around here who uh, have some items of interest to me because they're mine. Hmm. Mace. I wonder if it's as good an enchanted mace as the one that I have. Almost assuredly not. Eh. If we ever feel like it, maybe we can identify it. Whoa! A magma elemental. Magma elemental, you need to chill out! He's slightly injured by that. I was hoping you would be more injured than that. Now you're heavily injured. That's more like it. And now you're dead. That's a whole lot like it. Let's sleep. Hey, sleeping worked. I'm down with sleeping working. Hooked on sleeping works for me. Yeah, that was a secret door. This is an air elemental. I'm guessing that's even stronger than a dust elemental. Look at the damage it's doing. At least it's staggering from my furious assaults. I've got that going for me. Whew. Now then, let's sleep a little more. Oh, goblin fighter, you are a caution. Perhaps I should have heeded your caution. Oh, wow. I'm so badass now I can uh, kill young red dragons without even uh, giving it a second thought. I'm a badass. Nah. That was uh, a little more of everybody's favorite character, Rembrandt, from uh, the Let's Play Together that I'm currently doing with Mysterious JG. Go check out Mysterious JG's channel for our Let's Play Together of the Warriors, as well as his Let's Plays of Bullet Witch. Freaking Dark Wraith. The, uh, let's play a freaking Dark Wraith is an especially good one. And he's making me feel stupid. I'm losing mana. No. I'm gonna be so stupid by the time he's. Uh, I'm not gonna try and disarm like potions. I'm stupid enough now that I'll, uh, you know, I'll be wanting to disarm a trap, and it'll say, uh, "You decide to chew on shoe leather instead." Oh boy. Wow, that sounded uh, unintentionally quantum leap-like. I'm going to run away from this magma elemental and hope that uh, I can hide behind a door. Maybe even two doors. And sleep for a while. Oh, I did sleep for a while. He's young. Maybe I can kill him with just clubbing blows. Yes. Oh, sorry, get, not close. And, let's try sleeping again. Friggin' manticores, man. I know I'm physically stronger than manticores. You gotta give me that. How old are you? You are a young adult. <sighs> oh, but you shoot electricity. I don't care about your shooting electricity. 
I'm um, actually, if you could shoot some electricity. Yeah, see? I don't care about that. I should probably save, though. Or, uh, heal. Yeah, keep attacking with electricity. And give me the gold. I want the gold! This is going to be a long way back to health. And there we are. All the way back. Now then, let's look at the map. Where do we have left to go except into the crazy chamber of stone giants? Oh, also did, uh, never mind. Nope, I didn't gain back my intelligence. I'm going to have to go out and shell money, shell out money for it. Look, arrow elemental. I really would rather not deal with you. You're critically injured. Good. Oh, he resisted the attack. Mm. This is so, so difficult. Alright. We're now in a room with... Is this anything other than a giant trapdoor spider? It's just a regular giant trapdoor spider. You guys haven't been threatening for a little while now. As weird as you look. Oh, he's an adult red dragon. This could be rough. Rough. Wow. He's going to kill me. There's nothing I can do. If he breathes fire again, he's going to toast me. I have a charmed amulet to resist fire, don't I? Nope, it's resist cold. Well, I can just say good night then. He's critically injured. Come on. What? That's all he had? Oh, you. You know what? I don't even care, man. Go ahead, make me feel weak and stupid and just generally worthless. <laughs> These pale wraiths, they just have no respect for anybody. Let's sleep. I feel a little stronger. I guess because none of those things killed me. That can only make me stronger. Okay, so here's another room. In this room. In this room. I don't know what's been with the uh, Beach Boy references lately. Uh, I don't know what it is, folks, but uh, I'm sure I'll have it out of my system in no time. Uh-oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, wait, let me see what my character stats are. Yeah, look at all the intelligence that I've lost. <sighs> I feel so stupid. I've probably lost strength. I've probably lost a lot of things. I could have sworn there was another stone giant around here someplace. All right. Wow, there's a lot of manticores along this uh, hallway, apparently. I'm going to cast a spell of healing just to make sure that I don't die to a manacore. But I don't 
anticipate that he was going to cause me too much trouble. Maybe I should have, because he sort of did. Alright. All the doors are sealed. No one can get in. It's my little panic room. Except for the staircase. But, the enemies don't come down the staircase unless they follow me. Because otherwise, they have no idea how stairs work. It's a well-known fact that monsters do not understand stairs. Hey. Young dragon, get out of my way. Boy, this guy keeps casting. Smirking thief, he is dead. Give me the silver. I want the silver. Give me the silver. He had no gold, unfortunately, so I cannot say. Give me the go- Hey, it's the wizard! I wonder if he will, uh... Star... In, uh, a movie about... Oh, jeez. I need to save. I mean, I need to heal. Okay, so you cast a cold bolt. You know what? Take that. Yeah, I don't care. The wizard hit me. Like, physically? You're just gonna, like, whack at me with your little wizard stick? Come on, wizard. He splintered blood and sprayed gore, but he didn't have a thing on him. You would think he would have a magic wand. But, you know, I'm overthinking these things. Fred Savage was a wizard and he didn't have a magic wand. Well, at least that I'm aware of. Actually, I never did see that movie. You would think. Considering I'm a dude that plays video games a bunch, I would have seen Fred Savage in The Wizard. But it didn't happen. Just didn't. Alright. Let's save and go down another floor. We're starting to get fairly deep into this dungeon, aren't we? Interesting. We're not starting next to a wall. This would seem to be a very large room. With a dust elemental in it. All he is is dust in the wind. And I... It is an uninjured wolf man, baby. And now I am injured. That's not cool, brother. And shadows. Yep. Shadows. Well, okay, so this... Wait a minute. <sighs> Friggin' hunger hungerers. Look, sir. I know. I knew Hrungnir. I fought Hrungnir, and you, sir, are no Hrungnir. And he wasn't. I mean, he went down like a sack of bricks. <sighs> and not particularly graceful sack of bricks. Hey, it's a uh, huge ogre. Man. This place is uh, busy. It's it's jumping. There's a lot of enemies here. And actually, I kind of like these enemies because they're not ones that are casting magical spells, elemental effects, things that are causing me a lot of trouble. They're just trying to hit me. And I can deal with somebody just trying to punch my uh, Castle of the Winds guy. Because uh, I was hit by fire. And rusty bracers. Not going to carry the rusty bracers. Useless dead weight. Alright, let's explore this empty room. And confirm that it is, in fact, an empty room. And then let's, uh, head on over this way. And a shadow! See? Shadows. I like shadows. They imply that a room is illuminated. See? It's optimism, folks. And there's a rat man. I'm optimistic we can beat the Ratman. And we did. I'm Bubba the Vulture. Thanks for watching. Bye.